Welcome to Alley Picked. There's a ton of cool projects that you can make using old wood. But sometimes barn wood costs more than new wood itself. But what if there was a product that you could simply brush on and it would age the wood in minutes instead of years? Well, Verathane has this product called Weathered Wood Accelerator. It claims to be able to make the wood look old in 30 to 60 minutes. So I'm excited to see if that really works. We're going to put it to the test with eight samples of wood. I've got all different varieties and we're going to apply it as per the instructions and see if it really works. Afterwards, I'll let you know whether this stuff is good or garbage. Stay tuned. Before we begin, I'll pour the contents into a clear glass jar to see what it looks like. The label doesn't say what's in it other than it's water-based product. My first impression is that it looks like food coloring in water. The claim of this product, as I read it directly from the can, is it replicates the aging process that happens in nature by reacting with the tannins in the wood to create a unique, one-of-a-kind aged gray look. That's quite a claim. Now I call into question that claim because how can you actually replicate something and then end up with it being unique? Just makes me say, hmm. I have here three samples of naturally aged wood. They've lived outside for over 10 years. We're going to use these as a comparison to our samples after applying the secret sauce. Here we are one hour later. After one coat, I'm not impressed. I really wanted this stuff to be good. It looks to me like watered down paint. Here it is side by side with real aged wood and there's just no comparison. Out of all the samples, I'd say that the poplar wood is the closest to looking like real aged wood. The instructions do say that you can darken it up with a second coat. Let's try that. Here's the results after applying the second coat. Eh, not much better. It just looks like washed out gray paint to me. In fact, let's make some washed out gray paint and see how it compares. I'm using this cheap gray bottle of acrylic craft paint, which you can buy just about anywhere. I'll add a little water to thin it out. You can add more or less depending on how dark you want it. Here it is after it dries. It looks comparable to me, maybe even a little better. Here you can see the results side by side, my acrylic paint with the wood accelerator product. Let's try one more test. The label on the can states that the wood accelerator reacts with the tannins of the wood. That sounds like a chemical reaction to me. So if I take a wet paper towel and wipe it on the wood surface, it should come up clean and not discolor the wood. So let's recap. 
I gave it one coat and it looked like gray washed out paint. After two coats, it looked like slightly darker gray washed out paint. Then we made some gray washed out paint using acrylic and water. And we got some comparable results. Lastly, I took a paper towel and wet it and wiped the surface of the wood and a lot of the color came off, which tells me that it's more of a surface colorant rather than something that reacts with the tannins in the wood. So is this stuff good or is it garbage? I say garbage. However, there is a money back guarantee on the product. So if you don't like it, you always have that. I, however, will probably keep it just in case I need it for something, but definitely it will never replace good old fashioned weathered wood. Thanks for watching Alley Picked. I hope you learned something. I hope I saved you 12 bucks. Please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to 